April 1st is a day widely renowned across the world as a day of pranks. Uh, There's a woman, Susan Hudson. She is at least a celebrity on our show. Oh, yeah. She goes back years and years as being a, a part of the fabric of this show. And maybe even a poster child for what not to do on April Fool's Day. So um, I have the original news report, which accounts Susan's bad decision from the start. A favorite day for pranksters is the time of year when you're never really sure what's the truth. Uh huh. One veteran on April Fool's Day jokes during Kingsport had it all planned out. I do April Fool's Day jokes all the time, okay? This year would be the best yet. (laughs) Okay, so so she, out the gate, she's just like, yep, I do these all the time. I'm kind of a veteran. A prank for her sister. I was doing an April Fool's joke. I said, Helen, I shot my husband. Uh I'm cleaning up the mess. Let's go bury him in Blackwater. Okay, so (laughs) if we can stop it there and just say, Susan, that's not a good April Fool's no, joke. No, it is not, because what do you think her sister said to that? Yeah, you heard correctly. She told her sister she murdered her husband. Sister Helen called another family member. Somebody called 911. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, you, you think? You it was going to get there. Right, it was going to escalate to the police. The sure. next thing I knew, there was law everywhere. The next thing I knew, there was law everywhere. <laughs> I mean, she, and then she compliments him. The response was excellent. Absolutely, yes. <laughs> of they course. are professionals. Of course. Their, their response was excellent. Uh-huh. Um, now from the police. Kingsport police staged outside of Hudson's pastel yellow house, guns drawn as they prepared themselves for a bloody murder scene. Yeah. Like, yeah. I mean, you know, you get that call that there's been a homicide. Right. And, you you know, take all those calls seriously. Right. So then they got to talk to neighbors. And I thought it was somebody, some big man going to come out there. Here comes the woman out in the handcuffed her, put her in the car. And I thought, well, what in the world she done? <laughs> well, what in the world <laughs> she <laughs> done? Uh, Susan's April Fool's Day joke. But inside, they only found Hudson. And she started to learn the joke might be on her. Oh, she started to learn oh, that. Okay. Wait, you guys are here to talk to me? In April Fool. April Fool. The Fool was her. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, he looks exactly how he sounds. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. Now, uh, with every lesson, and, you know, we do setting the bar stories on the show all the time, there's always a moral to the story, right? Sure. Yeah. What do you think the moral Susan took away from this? And she just might agree. Be careful on the April Fool's jokes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Susan. Yes. <laughs> We've learned about that. OMG. Uh, If you want to see Susan, she literally looks exactly how she sounds. Yes. Uh, We've got it up at WDJX.com and we'll tweet it at Ben and Kelly show. Again, one. Kids, we don't joke about murder. (laughs) No, no. We do not. That is no, 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 no. Let let, let Susan be an example of what not to do today. All right. (laughs) In her mind, she thought that she had the most epic of pranks. In her mind. Be careful on the April Fool's jokes.